What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Skyla Felice. That's Born Simmer on TikTok and Scott Simmer on Twitch. Hey, what's up? Hello. How you doing? And if you're returning, then hey, boo. You know we locked in, baby. And if you're new here, then hey, baby. Welcome to the channel. Y'all, today, I really just wanted to bring y'all a bunch of overrides that I have in my game because look, we love realism over here. Like, it's my favorite thing. We're already addicted, so let's get into it. <laughs> now, if y'all have any questions, comments, concerns, then you know you can leave them in the comments. But every link will be in the description. So we just gonna get right into it. Let's go. Now, the first thing that I want to point out to you guys is that I'm actually playing Phoenix right now. But can we see that something is missing? Okay, baby, because there's no plumb bob. Get into it. <laughs> now, y'all, this is one of my favorite overrides because I actually hate the plumb bob. And that's because, one, I'm a creator, so I don't always want to see that in my videos or trying to not get it in my machinima. So that's the first one I wanted to point out. Like, it's just 10 times better without the plumb bob. Now, some of y'all might like it but not me, okay? So let's just move on. <laughs> now, quick note. The next one I wanna show you guys is a override for when The Sims use the restroom. Um, if I need to blur it out, I will, because some of us have mods that we do not speak about, okay? <laughs> yeah, we, we're gonna have to blur my good sis out. But anyway, we'll see that once she get done using the restroom, now my good sis can wipe. That's the second override that I wanted to go over with you all. Now, that's another one that I just love for realism because let's get into it. I'm not gonna keep saying it. Like we just love the realism. Now, next I'm gonna have her come over here and go to sleep so we can look at the no Z's mod. Now, this is an override for the Z's so we don't see Z's when they're asleep anymore. I don't know about y'all, but I prefer not to see disease okay look there's no z's there i don't know if it bothers anybody that just plays the game for fun but for me the no z's is essential for my gameplay but real quick a lot of us already know this one i'm gonna go ahead and kill um two birds and one stones and i'm gonna have her come order some pizza so we're gonna do a pizza delivery, order us a um, pepperoni pizza. But let's turn around. And as you can see, my sis has an iPhone 12. So let's get real close and personal. So this is another override that I just wanted to point out to y'all. A lot of us already have our phones overwritten in the game because period. But <laughs> this is just another one that I want to point out for the new simmers or ones who don't have it yet. It's just really cute. Now, look, I do want to say this. The creators make notes that you should choose only about one color if you you know, don't want it to keep switching back and forth between different colors or even just to avoid it not showing up at all. Now, me, sometimes I don't listen. I'm gonna just say that because it's true. So I have multiple different colors and it keeps popping up different colors for different Sims. But to me, that's not a problem. So I'm gonna just put that out there. But look, y'all, it's really overridden like a real text and that is so cute. So my sis is sending off a text right now and I love that it just looks like a real iPhone mesh. Now we're just gonna jump into some household things. I know y'all see that table is there. So we'll just go ahead and do that while we're waiting on the pizza. I'm gonna have her come over here and play cards with her father. Cause look y'all, my sis can play spades. She can play spades with her daddy, and I know that's right. If y'all have family gatherings, this the one, okay, period. So this overrides the gameplay table. And then another thing to note with this um, override is when you go to the link, you can choose which game cards you want to have in your game. So you can either put these black ones in there. There's the white cover ones. Um... I'm pretty sure y'all know what, I, what I'm talking about. It's the bicycle cards, spades, but white. And then you can also choose Uno as well. Look, the decks are so freaking cute. I'm going to be using this in one of my next videos so that I can get into some family things, okay? Now, that's why I said I love this because it's for the family, okay, period. And now y'all going to get on me. 
Because I'm a black girl that don't know how to play spades. Don't don't do too much. I've been trying to learn, okay? I wasn't at the table with the old heads when I was a kid. But now I'm getting to be a little auntie age. So, yeah. I'm going to learn for the culture. Yeah, don't get on me. <laughs> now, look, y'all. Right on time, we have the next override that I want to show y'all. She comes to deliver us a pizza. And it's Domino's. Get into it, okay? Now, I just had to do this. One thing about it... I'm a pizza girl. I'm a vegetarian now, but I'm still a pizza girl. It's just that, okay? I used to love pepperoni pizza before I went and stopped eating meat. But this one is super cute. First of all, she is wearing her Domino's outfit, but also the mesh is going to be really cute. Let's get back into the hat. I already pointed it out once before. <laughs> I've already pointed it out once before, y'all, but she won't let that hat go. But look, look at the mesh. It's giving real. It's giving tasty. Like, I can almost take a bite out of that if I ate that. <laughs> but no, this looks good. Like, for real. It's giving. Like, hold on, let's do a little close up. Is it not mouth watering? Is it not giving fresh? Now, you can choose from, I believe, Pizza Hut or Domino's on this override. If there's another one, then I'm not really sure which one it is. But I know for sure you can choose between Domino's and Pizza Hut. And you might even be able to get more than one. I'm not sure. Don't quote me on that. Just check the description. Okay, here she comes, y'all, to show you the next override. And this is actually a sack lunch override. So this allows for you to get a new sack lunch or lunch box, because that's what I call it. I don't know what y'all call it, where y'all from, but this is called a lunch box where I'm from. So this um, override right here, there's plenty of lunchbox overrides that you could choose from. You can either choose to just change the color of the sack lunch or you can pick out a lunchbox that you want to appear in your game. Make sure that you read the description and you choose wisely when it comes to picking because like I said, you can only have one of your game or it's going to choose for you. So there's that. If you don't mind, then just throw it up in there, baby. But it's super cute. And then look, it fits perfectly in this family because she has a little boy. So that is so freaking cute. Now, the next thing I'm gonna have her do is come over here and clean up for me. So I can show you guys the sponge override. Now look, this override, I just love the realism, okay? Like I can't even get into it with y'all because y'all already know, y'all already understand. That's why y'all here. But this is just a sponge override. Now I love it because I just like for my game to exude realism and I'm working on a realistic game file or a save file. So yeah, that was the next one that I wanted to show y'all and then look, she just use it whenever she needs to use it. We're not gonna do too much. We're not gonna do too much. Now the next override that we're gonna get into involves cooking. Um, It's really just a override for the cutting board. But look y'all, let's get into it. Look at the cutting board. I'm loving it. Like I love it. This would be a cutting board that I have in my house. We don't want that boring cutting board. We want this one. Give us this one. Now, like I said, it's usually more than one option when you go to the creator's page. So make sure you check the description because there are two versions. I chose this one because, duh, it looks good. But the other one is more like of a rectangle shape without the little handle. And it's like this color. Now, I don't know if y'all have noticed, but everything has been categorized very neatly it's really categorized neatly now this override is the better pie menu so this is going to be in the description as well it's just more helpful to help us find exactly what we're looking for so i'll put that in the description just in case you guys were like mm, that's really neat it helps her find everything that she needs to find quick and easy okay y'all so the next one that i want to get into is right over here i know y'all already like dang that is cute because what like it's exuding 
black excellence. I don't know why it says poor painting because this right here is given. Now this is a mod that wasn't released so long ago. It was really like a couple of weeks ago maybe maybe days ago but it was released this month and it's a new mod it's the black art paints override i believe black art painting but i'm going to make sure that i put this in the description as you all know but shout out to this creator because this looks so freaking good okay hold on y'all i decided that i wanted her to do another classic painting we're gonna do a medium classic painting this time and like i said i'm gonna speed it up it's already giving life. It's already giving life. Oh my gosh, y'all. I'm so excited to see the end of it. And like I said, this is fairly new. So I'm really just now seeing all of the paintings that it comes with as well. I believe this creator did over 50 overrides of this. I believe it was somewhere around 100. So again, big shout out. Like, look how cute. Is giving body yada yada <laughs> like for real. This is so cute, y'all. I love it. I love this so much. So y'all know y'all need to get into it. Now, right now, I will throw in here that it's behind a paywall right now, rightfully so, because it just came out. It's only five dollars to subscribe to this um creator on Patreon. I'm not sure when it comes out, but I would just keep a lookout for it if you're not ready to pay for it yet because this is a need. Okay, let's get into it. Let's just go ahead and move to the next override. Now, the next override that I want to get into is going to override the PC games. It's going to say these games, but we'll see what happens when we click on it. But y'all can see it looks like maybe a Fortnite, a Fortnite type of game. But look how cute, because like I said, we're exuding realism over here. And then I'm going to have him demonstrate one more on the game. Now, when you download this, it's going to say the exact games that they're playing. Now, I don't know why mine is tweaking, but at least we know it works. Because look, when we click on Play Sims 4, it's actually GTA. So when your game is going to say the right one, I think that I might have another override that conflicts with it, but that's a story for another day. Because look, period. That's all we're trying to get into is the realism and the gameplay. That's all. So I'm going to go ahead and move on to the next override. But come over here and dance for us. Give us a little show real quick, Percy, because the next override that we're going to get into is actually a dance override. So we'll have him come over here real quick. But yeah, let's watch him, y'all. He's going to give us a good little show. Look at that. Now, the reason why I love this one is because I be hating how they dance. Like, <laughs> they dance so ugly, y'all. Y'all know what I'm talking about. I can't even give y'all an example because I don't have the regular dancer anymore in my game. But this one is just going to give us more dance overrides. It's giving us like more realistic dancing, okay? Because you won't catch nobody in the club doing that look him at shit <laughs> like we're not gonna see that in the club okay period now while we're here in the kitchen we're gonna go ahead and move on to the next mod or override so we're gonna go ahead and click on watch movie because i actually have an override that overrides the movie so with this um mod you can actually choose between which movies you want to override you cannot have more than 10 in your game at a time so make sure when you extract it that you go into that folder that you put it in and you only choose the 10 that you want to have in your game. Now, for me, I'm a reality TV girl. OK, I love reality TV. Now, baby, I know it's fake, but it's entertaining. OK, so anyway, I have Love and Hip Hop, Fix My Life, Growing Up Hip Hop, Flavor of Love, Bad Girls Club, Basketball Wives, Black Ink Crew and then flavor of love <laughs> so uh we also have rupaul and we have real housewives of atlanta so i'm gonna go ahead and go back in and click on that one because period and then first let's see this uh remote real quick i gotta be quick i gotta be quick y'all gonna have to watch because <laughs> this is a remote override that i want to show y'all 
quick. I was quick on it. Did y'all see that? But look, this is the remote override that I wanted to get into with y'all and let y'all see. The reason why I have this one is because it's pretty self-explanatory. I said it a million times. The realism is real. Okay, period. Now, this is the one that I love for the remotes. And then let's take a look at the TV real quick. Look at that. Nene, baby. Period. And Phaedra. This one, you can pick and choose between which ones you want to put in your game. Once again, there's some anime. There's some animation, like kid movies from Disney Channel. We got some... um like more black sitcom shows like Moesha, Smart Guy, Wayne's Brothers, things like that. And we even got some movie overrides in there. So y'all need to go to this creator's page and pick and choose between which ones you want to have in your game. Because once again, you can only have 10 in a game at the time. Okay, period. The next override I'm going to show you guys, I'm going to come up here to the PlayStation 5 game. And I'll go ahead and click on play... Um, grand blue fantasy i'm gonna go ahead and have percy come up here and get onto the game for us so we can see this now this is going to be a controller override as well as a game override so get into it y'all look now this actually overrides both the game and the controller so i don't know if y'all can see the controller but look how cute it's actually a Switch controller. Obviously, this is a PlayStation 5, but I do also have a Switch. So I can put the Switch up here as well to give it more of an aesthetic, but it does override both. So I thought I should show you guys that because look, who wouldn't want to have a real game controller in there and also a real game? So yeah, let's get into this. Let's get a closer look, y'all. It's really realistic, okay? So we love to see that. I bet y'all didn't know that Percy had a grill, huh? Yeah. <laughs> but anyways, y'all, that is the next one that I wanted to show you guys. And we're just going to jump right into the next one. So the next few mods that I want to show you guys does come from the phone. So I have an override that overrides travel. And this has an Uber icon. And then I also have one that overrides Social Bunny to be Twitter. So these are both by Coco Games, which she's always giving us realism. So shout out to you, babe, because you be doing your thing. But it is still going to function just like it's supposed to. And then as well as Social Bunny, it does um, say Twitter now but it still definitely functions as social bunny so definitely have to check that one out the next one is going to be a override for the selfies now this is for the paired selfies i do have one for a singular selfie but it's pretty hard to find and locate in there so i'm gonna just show you guys the paired ones now if you go to the cool or relax <laughs> You can go ahead and switch up the poses and I'm going to show y'all which ones. Bam, look how cute. So this is the first pose. Super freaking cute. Second one. And then this is another one that's so cute. I don't want to take a picture because it might get me out of it. But look how cute this is. This is so freaking cute. I okay. can't. Then let me see. This is another one that is super freaking cute, y'all. I cannot. This is a need because we all know that the selfies that they be taking, it don't give like this is going to give. So this is super cute. And I love that one so freaking much. Now, there is another one for flirty. I know they daughter and I know they dad and daughter, but we going to just this is just to show y'all. Now, look how cute, y'all. That is so freaking cute. Oops, excuse me. But this is so cute. We have another one here. And get into the nails. Just as it's always a vibe. Okay, period. So cute. Too freaking cute. But those are pretty much all of them. You can find them in relaxed. You can find them in flirty. And you can find it in exciting. Now, as you can see, we're in San Mashuno. But there is something pretty different about it. So take a look here, y'all. We got some cute billboards now. Now, look, this is about <laughs> three years old. So be mindful of that. That I know we got a PlayStation favorite. 
I know we got PlayStation 5 now, and I know we got Fashion Nova now. Like, well, we had Fashion Nova back then, but y'all get what I'm saying. But this is still a need, especially in my book, because like I said, I'm trying to get into more realism. So right here, we just have some really cute um, overrides for the billboards. And I just feel like, once again, it just brings in more realism. We don't have to deal with all... Some people love it, and that's no shade to the Maxis Match community because sometimes I want to play that way too. But when I'm trying to be realistic, I love that I can be. So these billboards are really cute. This one, if it switches again, it has like some Nike billboards going on. And then as y'all can see, off into the distance, we got some more billboards over here. I'm trying to give us as much as I can, y'all. Look how cute. I love it. Like, get into it. Look at this. This is the Beyonce album. <laughs> but the next ones I'm going to show you guys is actually by uh, J. Renee Gaming. So let's go ahead and travel over to uh, Del Sol Valley. All right, y'all. So go ahead and take a look. Go ahead and take a look because I know y'all see it. Now, this one is actually the next Billboards override that I was going to show you guys. First of all, if you watch about... I love you <laughs> because we're the same. Okay, period. I love that show so much. So I had to have this set of billboards in my game because yes, yes, ma'am, get into it. Now we got the 911 off into the distance. We got Grey's Anatomy back there, home, really a bunch of like cute black movies that I just love so much. We got Dope back there in the uh, distance. I don't really... Jasmine Blue Swat. I can't really tell what that one is. It looks like Atlanta, perhaps. I got some good eyes. Let's get into it. Stop playing. And then look, y'all, we got Wakanda Forever. So this is just another billboard override that I felt like was very much needed, especially if you're just wanting it for gameplay. So you can do some machinima that includes it. And then look, y'all, even over here, we got some like American Horror Story going on. Station 19, Law and Order. So yeah, this is really giving for me. I love it. And I'm just not even going to do too much because you guys get it. You get it. I know you do. <laughs> Okay, y'all, so we are in cast, and I just want to show you guys one of the overrides that I picked up. So first off, I know y'all can see the froggy cushion that I have. So this overrides the cushion that is in a cast when you are when you are editing an infant so i will have this in the description of course and then i just picked up this diaper override so let's look at how cute this is look how cute y'all now this is a diaper override that's giving me like huggies vibes so i definitely felt like it was a need because yeah we just don't want no boring diapers in the game so period all right y'all so we are now in strangerville and as y'all can see it looks a little a little bit different now y'all this override right here really pretty much overrides the rocks so we got some different rocks here and they're so cute like honestly strangerville is kind of a vibe aesthetically don't okay it's giving me like arizona or something i've never been to arizona so if you from there don't get on me because i'm not even trying to be funny i'm just saying like it gives me like it just kills me. I would just leave it there, honey, because it's not that serious. Now, it overrides some of the rocks um, terrain and also some of the trucks. So let me come over here to the trucks to look at that as well. I'm going to be real with y'all. I only seen Strangerville without this override through pictures because as soon as I had this, I went and got this override because I seen it and I was like, yeah. So look, it overrides the terrain to give it a more realistic vibe so this is super cute to me and then some of the trucks are overridden as well so you guys got to get into it now 
this is another one once again that you can pick and choose what you want from it so if you don't want to override the rocks if you don't want to override the trucks if you don't want to override the terrain you don't have to you can pick and choose what you want to override so last but not least i almost forgot to show you guys this override that i have for something in the cool kitchen stuff pack now this mod overrides the milk bottle for um the cool kitchen stuff pack and i almost forgot to show you guys so this one right here is another one where you can pick and choose which ones you want to put in there's also one for um oat milk there's some korean ones i believe some japanese replacements so you need to go to the creator and you got to look through the description for which ones that you want to use i chose the english version so that's what this one is right here and it's pretty much just going to override that milk bottle for us to give us a more realistic feeling okay so yeah i thought that was really cute i thought i should go ahead and add that one in there but that's pretty much wraps up today's video so today we just went over some overrides i'm going to be dropping more videos this week so y'all know y'all want to subscribe and hit that bell because you don't want to miss it from here now guys i just want to point out that on my community tab i'm always trying to get your opinion on what you guys want from me so make sure that you're staying tuned for that and if you have been voting on it or just interacting with me then i appreciate you so much baby you showing how much we locked in period <laughs> so from here on out guys i just want to say thank you so much for the subs thank you so much for the love please continue to like and share for me and i hope you guys stay tuned for more i'll see you in my next video